oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness, the genetically blessed Victoria Michaels has made and released another video. <gasps> and this one's gonna be all about how to style this updo that I'm wearing, this beautiful big hair, and how you too can look this beautiful. This wiglet has been brushed out. She's ready to go. She's a pretty big unit at the moment. The first big job is to get all of the hair up in the air. We're gonna do that in two parts. We've gotta get them all up essentially into a big ponytail or a big bun on top of the head. So what I've done is any hair in the front section, so front section being from the end of the lace forward and in a sort of a straight row over, I've just put it out of the way for now and we're dealing with the back half. The basic idea is that we're gonna just grab all the hair and push it up like so. Can see there what I've done and then we're just going to brush it to try and get it a bit tighter and neater. Once we have the hair up into the position you want and it's centered just use a hair elastic or like a hair tie to put that all up. Now that the back half is up we're just going to spray a bit of hairspray just to sort of tidy up any little hairs you can just use your brush and just gently sort of smooth them all down, yes. We have the back half all up, now it's time to get the front half where we want it. So you want to just grab all the remaining hair, easily take the clip out, and we're going to just continue the same process, but with the front half. Now that we've got the front half in the sort of the position we want it to be in, we're going to grab another elastic and tie that one up, and then we're going to put another elastic around both ponytails to secure them together. We have it up in a ponytail, yay. Final thing to do is we're just gonna spray down the front area and just, you know, clean it up a little bit. Now I'm gonna just use another elastic to bundle up the hair and get it into a nice sort of tidy bunch on top out of the way. We're done with the first wig, which is very, very exciting. Um, we now need to focus on how we're gonna make those beautiful curls that sit on top. You could maybe use this hair up here, but personally, I'm gonna use a second wig. I have this old, 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 old lace front, which just happens to be the same color lying around. I cut all the lace off it. It's a manky old thing. We're gonna stick it on top using a whole lot of bobby pins. ready to roll, it's time to do the curls. Um, we're gonna grab a portion of hair, I pre-grabbed one, using the teasing comb and just smooth it out, making sure it's sort of all nicely held together. Then using a roll, I don't know, curler, you're just gonna grab the hair, wrap it around inside of it, going towards the front, and we're rolling to the bottom. And then just hold it for, I don't know, 30 seconds or so. And then gently take it out and then right there and then you can actually just pin it straight away. So what I'm doing is just putting a bobby pin um, through the whole curl just to hold it, hold it there. You can sort of spread it out and then just give it a small, small little burst of hairspray. Gorgeous, number one done, 100 to go. We're done with the bottom layer at this point, which is exciting. So we're gonna start moving up to the next tier. With the second tier, I would generally grab a portion of hair for the next curl that sits in between the two curls that are existing. So, because otherwise it'll look like a weird sort of row. So if you do it alternating in between the gaps, it kind of fills it up a bit more and just looks a bit nicer.
We've done another lay on. Time to go up. Oh, it's done. Yay. Now reaching the top, we're going to do those final curls and just try and fill in the space at the top and just make it look nice and party. Ah, here we go. Time to do the final curl. Oh, I'm so excited. And it's done. We have our little updo, she's all looking beautiful. Look at that, nice and tidy. I've just sprayed it with hairspray, uh, tidied up a couple of curls, and let's try her on. Ah! What do you think of the finished hair on? Isn't it gorgeously glamorous and beautiful and stylish? <laughs> you too should be able to make this hair now. I am so excited to be sharing all these videos with you guys, so uh, make sure you like and subscribe, um, comment away, share it, whatever you want to do. Make sure you follow me on my other channels as well, so uh, Instagram is Victoria underscore Michaels, and you can find me on Facebook and TikTok and so forth. Otherwise, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.